So in this video, I just figured I might as well entertain you guys with some footage and let me know what you think. I'm gonna head over to my boy's house. I got some transmission fluid. We're gonna put some new transmission fluid in the moped and we're just gonna go ahead and do that. So let's take a trip over there, but first I need to figure out how to secure this. So we're gonna go ahead and try to do that. All right, looks good to me. I think that'll stay just fine. Yeah. I'm not bringing any tools because I'm pretty sure he has some tools that I'm just gonna do, but it's pretty simple, transmission fluid. I'll explain when we get there exactly uh, the reason I'm doing this right now, so let's do it. We made it! All right, moped's cooling off by the second. I just rode it here to warm it up. We got the other moped over here. Basically the same thing's about to go on right now. It's so changing the transmission. Simultaneous oh transmission Hold on. Hold on. fluid. Hold on. Hold on. What's up? Um, I'm gonna go ahead and jack this pan that's under here. The oil was supposed to be draining out of this, but I don't think it's actually draining right now. We're gonna shift her over here. There we go. Dude, did you run your moped before this? No. Yo, is she stone cold right now? That's, that's against moped law. The law of moped physics. All right, yo, go, go take her for a little, Go take her for a little whip. Little whip. Just a little whip. Just because you gotta warm that thing up. So yeah. it runs out real nice. Do you have a, an adjustable? Oh, excuse me. I gotta get the small pad through here. Oh, yep. Alright. Well, I'll see you later. Let me know when it's, uh, when she's warm. Okay. You know, maybe I'll come, I'll come with you for a little ride. Alright. <laughs> I feel like I should probably like make the effort to find the right size, but moped life. This thing's gonna be kind of hot, isn't it? <sighs> it's okay. Feel the pain. Breathe the pain. We're going two hands. Boy, am I glad I have gloves on right now. Dude, this plug's longer than I remember. Ah, there she is. My exhaust pipe placement is just perfect. It drains right onto it and gets all over Will's floor. Good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah yeah yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I just want to see. I'm, I'm actually just more curious to see if there's even transmission fluid in mine. We're gonna inspect the drain plug for particles. Uh, what? Guy, what's up, guys? What's up, guys? <laughs> in this video, I've established that my moped is soft seizing, and I'm gonna have to uh, buy a new engine. All right, let's get this thing back in here. I think it's done. Hold on. Don't take yours out yet. I want to. I want to. I want to give them the full experience of your yours coming out. Oh yeah. Okay. <laughs> Comment down below if you want me to start it with no transmission fluid. All right. All right. So basically, so I've uh, never changed this transmission this, fluid. We're gonna see how much comes out because this transmission fluid has never been changed. Don't know if the original owner. This is uh, live right now. Oh, there we go. There, yep, that's nice. Come on, it can't be that hot. Come on, Chris, it's not that hot. Oh wait, dude, my moped's I, just better than yours. Do so I see it ran leaking? Hotter. Uh. Oh, there's like... <laughs> Is there nothing coming out? There's like nothing coming out. Bro. There was no fluid in there. That's the right plug? Yeah. The moped gods have spoken. No transmission fluid for you. Dude, like legit though. Like no wonder this thing doesn't run properly. Because there's no fluid in it. I wonder how long it's been like that. You know what? I would go ahead and message the seller to inform them that they sold you a moped with no transmission fluid. I still fluid. have the seller's contact. Actually, I know where the seller lives. We're about to go there. The thing still runs. That oh, yeah. is the yeah, true yeah, yeah. moped line. <sighs> Yo, look, hold on. Hold on. Let's take ahead. a trip to the old Z Z A fifty over here. We have Quick. different different kits, you right. Different setups here. Dude, obviously. I'm just trying to just trying to teach the world here. Uh so that's where my cap was, so that's where we're gonna fill it up. And then on the side this one is how you can check the fluid level. I'm sorry about your floors. I will clean it, I promise. Is this your trash can? That's not a trash can. No, that's a trash can. Oh, it is? That's one of those. I saw some brand new Nikes in here. I thought that, you know. It's just a box. Dude, what if I need a pair of shoes? So you're gonna fill it up all the way then? Because uh, since we don't know what level it's supposed to be. 5.7. 5.7, 10.7. That's what it said. 
Chris. Let's let them decide how much oil we put in it. Yo, where'd you buy this? This one looks a bit different than mine. Uh, AutoZone. Advanced wasn't open. I bet you this isn't even an automatic transmission fluid. Dude. I bet you. I bet you. You're gonna you know, spill it. I bet you I know what's in there. What? I bet you I know what's in Is there. Is it apple juice? No, better. <laughs> what? Fruit punch? I still haven't taken my transmission fluid off the back. Alright, this is real transmission fluid. This That's isn't- That's apple juice. Ow! Yes, that felt That's good. That's what happens when you lie. That's what happens when you're looking at the lens and not at what you're doing. Or whatever it's called. Yo, I need a flathead. Is this a flathead? Nope. That's not a flathead. Let's go on a search for a flathead, shall we? Flathead, flathead. Do you know where a flathead is? Alright, so this is our eyeglass thing here. So we can tell the fluid level of when to stop. So 28 minus 9.5 is what? We're gonna keep an eye on there. Apparently. Oh, she was thirsty, dude. My goodness. It looks so delicious. <laughs> so basically, we're out here doing mechanics work and, you know, hit me up if you want me to work on your car. I'd be happy to. I'll change the transmission fluid in that too if you want. Uh, I'll, I'll do an engine swap too. 2JZ swap if you want me to do it. I got the parts. I got the, I got the knowledge. I got the... Yeah. I can't wait to buy a Supra. No. I promise you I will buy a Supra and you're gonna like it! No. This plug has seen better days. What happened to your original plug? The original one's notorious for falling apart, like, and was starting to break apart, like, into my engine. So I had to make a new one. This took, like, an hour and a half to make. Out of a cork. Out of a cork. I'm like, Mom, uh, do you have a wine bottle? Chris, why? <gasps> no reason. I was running 10W30 in my pad. This is now... Automatic transmission fluid type F. So I ran the 10W30 because I wanted my first gear to last longer and second gear to take longer to engage. So let's try this out and see what it does. All right, let's see if this thing blows. Oh, no. It would help to turn off the kill switch. Okay, so moral of the story is, this fluid is lit. I don't know why I ever switched it out, but um, anyway. So yeah, it's gonna snow tomorrow, which is uh, why I decided to you know, film something different. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know down in the comments if you like the video, what videos you want me to make next, if you like this sort of thing, where I'm just kind of messing around with, you know, just changing transmission fluid. Normally it would be kind of boring, but if you find it entertaining, be sure to let me know. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace out.